Water's getting deeper, boys. And way deeper. Fish on! No. All right, guys. There you go. Happens once in a blue moon, I got a rock trout. Now these are a rare species that are only found in the driftless. And they like to eat. And when they get hungry, man, these, these, these rocks, they just go like cannibalistic and they just want to eat other rocks. And they're just like, oh man. But yeah, there's my, uh, I don't know, I think my second rock of the year, but he's a pretty big rock. He must be pretty hungry. All right, see, look at him. He just really wanted that lure. So there we go, rock. You're pretty cool, but we're gonna send you back. See you later, tater. Rockinator. Fun, fun, fun. Whoa. Whoa. Past the knees. That was scary. This is the kind of spot where you go down. Oh, like that. Look at that, man. I went up. I went up to my sack deep in the snow right here. Woohoo. Crispy. I didn't bring my gloves with either, so, so I can't touch it. Hands will get frozen real quick. You're gonna be get frozen anyways, touching the water if I catch something. I got a little bit of shelf ice here, but not a lot. I mean, there's just some along the shoreline. <laughs> I'm not thinking that spot is gonna be too awesome though, because uh, a little bit ago, and this giant tree above me coming up ahead, there's a bald eagle sitting up there. So any of these trout that are gonna be up here, they're gonna be deep, because uh, they're here, but they're gonna be deep down in the water, because uh, that eagle, like, he flew upstream and up around the corner to the next hole. God, just my luck, but maybe we'll still catch them. I've caught stuff on our eagle's nest before when they were sitting up in the nest, so maybe we'll see how it goes. Maybe we just find one that's hungry enough. I'm using a, Little uh, number four, or wait, yeah, well, maybe it's a number five. Gold blade, I got a tungsten weight on there, it's an eighth of an ounce. And a couple beads, a couple metal ones, and a size eight treble. I figured I'd go for something a little small. So uh, let's see what we can pull out of here with this sucker. Right in that current, let's see what's in there bubbling. Fish on, guys, fish on! Woohoo, fishy, fishy! Let's play, oh, look at this guy, he's jumping. He's leaping. He's a leaper. All right, dudes, check it out. You got a little brownie. He's not a, he's not a monster, but he's a, he's a fish, man. First fish of the day. Pretty happy, sweet. Let me get this guy off the hook here real quick. Get my hand wet. Get the other hand wet. This guy's set up where he needs to be. There you go, guys. First fish of the day, homemade spinners. This is to show you, you don't need to go spend a whole bunch of money to get spinners when you can just get one this way and make them yourself. And then go out and have the rewarding deal of catching fish. I hope that eagles, he's kind of flew off down that way. He's probably pissed because he's seen me catch his fish. Now he knows that he ain't gonna get no food out of this hole. All right, just a little dude. Just a little, tiny little brown, but he's uh, still a beauty and I'm really happy that he came to visit me and we'll send him on his way. There he goes. He's actually swimming downstream, so that works out pretty good for me. Get back in here and try again. See you shortly. All right, back for the attack. Gold is paying off. So far. Fish on, fish on. Woohoo, fishy, fishy. All right, guys, I got another one. I don't think this guy's getting off. Oh yeah, look at him, he's jumping everywhere. Who check him out, man? Oh, he got off. All right, see, that's why I usually try to uh, just pull him in right away instead of playing with him too much, because if you play with him and you watch him jump, yeah, you know, watch them jump off the hook. So, back shortly. All right, I think I'm kind of wore out this hole. 
And when I put the, uh, I just went back to mine. I mean, nothing else was working. And I got here, only thing that's working is this sucker so far. So we'll just toss this back on. I mean, even the Rapalas weren't paying off. And so just go with this guy. This guy caught me two fish. Maybe he'll catch me another one. Fish on, fish on, guys, fish on. Woo. He's a nice one too. Look at him over the bank here. Check that out, man. He's thrashing. Hold on, dude. I'm trying to come for you. I'm trying to grab the spinner. Well, there you go, guys. Look at that dude. Hopefully the camera's turned on. Is it turned on? It is. The camera's turned on. There you go, guys. I'm trying not to drop my thing. Oh, he got it pretty good. We're going to have to get him undone. He's bleeding. It's not good. There you go. Nice fish, dudes. We'll get him back in the water. He's got some scars on him. We'll see. He, he may not be doing too well, but we'll get him back in the water. Later, Tater. He's swimming back over there where he came from. There we go. Right off the bank. Who did I get a fish on right away? Looks like I got something. I think it's a, I bet you 10 bucks is a damn stick. Ah! What the hell's the matter with me, guys? There you go. Jesus. I just can't get a break. Well, at least I know there's not going to be any more sticks to get stuck on in that spot. God dang it, man. All right. Slayer Mike stick ex extraordinaire. Let's get this guy off here. And, you know, he looks like he's struggling. So he's a like a really cool twisted stick. And he's slimy like a northern pike. And... Yeah, screw it. Go away, stick. Go away. God, I can't believe that happened again. What the hell, man? Is it going to be like every time? Oh, I swear. You guys think I'm doing it to be funny, man. That's not funny. All I'm catching is these stupid sticks. It's like, what good is it doing me? So all those times I thought I had a fish on and I, think I thought he yanked it out of my hand. It was probably catching on a tree over there. All right, second spot, second location. We're upstream from where we were just at. There you go up here, give it a shot. See if we can pull anything out right up and through here. I'm not thinking of this section right here, here is really too great, but kind of shallow. I'm pulling this little tiny tungsten. But uh, once you get up here around the corner, there's a pretty big hole up there. Oh, there's a fish. Fish on, guys! Fish on! Ooh, this is a fat little boy. He's been eating good. Eating good in the neighborhood. All right. We got one, boys. We got us a little brownie. Came down from brown town to... Came downtown to hang out with Slayer Mike. All right, we'll get this guy off the hook. Hopefully quick. He's got it wrapped in there like a dumbass. All right, bud. No, actually, he's not on there bad at all. All right, guys. Let's get this camera adjusted. Check it out, man. This is a nice fish for the day. There's one of them, one of a few. Let's check it out. Not bad. He looks pretty good. We'll get him back in the water here and let him swim away. See you later, Tater. He just basically went up underneath this uh, log that's here in front of me. So he didn't look like he went back upstream. I didn't see him go that direction. So maybe we'll have a chance at catching another one. Then again, who knows? See how this goes. I've been seeing some big fish jump along the way. Holy crap, man. Just look at this. That's what a hole. Holy crap, hold man. It's up to my my waist. I'm gonna have a bitch of a time getting out of here. Holy shit, that was deep. Oh. Wow. That was like a, for sure, like a leg breaker. All right. I jumped out like a little kid. I ain't getting any hurt. Screw that. All right, they're already seeing fish. It's also silty. 
Ooh, crap. Okay. Are we moving and doing and grooving? Are you guys turned on? Looks like it. I think I should have took off my sweatshirt. It's gotta get warm. Let's just get first, first cast through here, see what we get. Anything chasing it? No. We got a stick, that's it. We gotta get up here farther. It's mainly about fishing holes. Right now there's a there's a hatch going on. So fish are active and eaten. It's kind of shallow up here. I think I just hooked into a stick, guys. Yay, stick number two. What a day. I tell ya. Here's another greasy stick. Stick number two, boys. Stick number two. Uh, stick number two. Stupid sticks. Every time it comes back, it grass and mud on it. That's all there is in this creek, is mud and grass. Yeah, the trout aren't moving, they're not, they're just sitting there. They're just sitting there looking at me. There's like a whole bunch of them down there. They're just not totally interested in anything I'm doing. Fish on, fish on, man. This is a decent one too. Check him out. Wow, dudes, check him out. He's a nice one. Woohoo, he jumped out of the water and everything. All right, check that guy out. Let me see the net. We can get him in the net. Can we get him in the net? Yes, we got him. Woohoo, guys, check this dude out. He's a nice one. Well, he's not a monster. It makes me happy. All right. Can you see that? Is it turned on? Better be. Can't even tell if it is. All right, it is. All right, guys, I'm gonna get my hand on sweat here. Get this guy off fast and get him back in the water where he wants to be. But yeah, check it out, guys. Caught him on my little homemade lure. There it is. Homemade lure all the way. Nice brown trout. So uh, we'll get this hook out of him. I gotta get the hemo. Sorry, bud. It's gonna take a minute. But you're lucky you got it right there in your corner of your lip. Come out nice and easy. Easy peasy. Look at that. Oh shit, one more time. One more time, bud. You almost we almost have you hooked. Undone. There we go. Alright guys. That's probably about the nicest fish of the day. And he wants to take off while he's swimming across my chest. Hey, get out of my air. Hey, this guy just swam into my armpit and into my waders. He wants to go. We're just gonna let him go, man. He's moving. But yeah, check him out, man. This guy wants to get the hell out of here, so he about took out my finger. Alright. Bye bye, dude. Oh, there he goes. He's swimming back into the hole where he came from. So there goes the chances of probably catching another one. But who cares? I caught a fish. Yay! Sweet. Yay! Look at that, guys. That's Grandmaster Stick right there in action. Look at the size of that stick with his little mess. It's like he's got a skirt on or something. He's got his little his little dress. And there's Stick number three. All right, well, oh, he's naked now. We gotta get him back in the water. Stupid stick. All right, I can't walk, apparently. I got rocks right in here. Your rocky, rocky spot. <clears throat> wow, check this out. This is, a, there's like a hole there, but it's like really super current. I don't know, we can give it a shot. I don't think it's gonna work, but it's one thing we can't get a line off the tip of our pole for some reason or another.
All right, let's go. I'm trying to do this trick shot bullshit. He can help you. Oh, get fall my face again. Oh my God, what the? Son of a, God damn it. Freaking war rocks. Oh well. At least the water ain't that super cold, apparently. Good God, I can't walk. So, hey guys, what's going on? Wanted to do an outro here, but it seems like every time I turn around, there's damn cars coming in. So, um, anyways, uh, I had fun out here. I had to go to three different places to catch fish, but you know, whatever, I caught fish. So, I caught something in every place that I went to. I even fell on my butt and there's a few surprises in between like the stick and the, the rock and what the hell man today has just been one of those kind of days so anyways uh thanks for tuning in checking out like subscribe okay hit that bell up here above me on this side over here probably there's going to be like a little thing there for videos you can go click on it watch some of the stuff i do see some of the tips and tactics i use on the trout streams and the drip list and uh yeah that's about it i here comes another right another stupid car so anyways i gotta go I'm gonna head home and edit this video. And uh, yeah, look at this beautiful sunny day. Talk to you later.